My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. This week's What's for Dinner is a little different. We took a road trip from Texas to Memphis, Tennessee for my cousin's wedding. You'll see a couple of meals I made at home and you'll also get to see what we ate on the road. So for dinner tonight, we are eating from our freezer and pantry. I found these teriyaki pineapple meatballs on clearance at Kroger a while back ago and stuck them in my freezer. So I've defrosted them. I'm going to pan fry them and then add some of this barbecue sauce that Howard and I really like a lot. And then I'm also gonna make some mac and cheese. I'm gonna be trying this mac and cheese from Trader Joe's for the first time. I had it in my pantry as well, but I was looking at the instructions on it, trying to find it. And all it says is to add two tablespoons of low fat milk. Doesn't sound that great to me. So I'm actually gonna follow the directions on Kraft, which calls for four tablespoons, I think, of butter, and then a fourth of a cup of um, milk because they're about the same size. And it sounds like this one might be a little dry. I don't know. But anyway, um, let me get started. Okay, so here is dinner. Here are the meatballs and the mac and cheese. The mac and cheese is actually pretty good. Now, I don't know if that's because I doctored it up. I ended up adding three tablespoons of butter instead of four, and I added a fourth of a cup of milk instead of two tablespoons, but it's really good, very creamy. Um, and then I decided to make some um, cut Italian green beans as well. So I have these in the freezer and I just pan fried them with olive oil and then I use some of this Creole seasoning on them. So quick and easy dinner tonight and we will see y'all next time. So for dinner tonight, Howard grilled out some ribeye steaks. I found these on clearance a while back ago. I got two of these steaks um, in the package and they were like six bucks, thin cut. I couldn't pass up that deal. So we grilled those and then we are having leftover mashed potatoes in the fridge. Just trying to use up what I have instead of just making stuff just to be making stuff. And then I sauteed some green beans. These are the frozen green beans from Trader Joe's that I really like a lot, extra fine French green beans. And as you can see, it's a 1.8 ounce package. And usually I get two dinners out of um, these green beans out of this package. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we will see y'all next time. Okay, so the videos for the rest of the week are gonna be on the road. Howard and I are on our first family road trip. We are headed from Texas to Memphis, Tennessee. We just pulled over. Uh, we are in Texarkana, which is East Texas. And we are eating at Sam's Eatery, Southern Eatery. So there's Harrison. Harrison, say hi. hi. Okay, you barely got a hi. So let me show you what I got. I got the Philly cheese steak and I got, it's cut in two. So here's one side and then the other side is uh, still wrapped up. And then I got French fries on the side. Let me show you Howard's plate. So Howard got um, red beans and rice. And what did you get again? It's a crawfish po' boy. And so he also has uh, two parts of his sandwich. He unwrapped one so you all could see it. Let me try to get in there a little bit closer. But anyway, this is what we are having for dinner tonight on the road. And I will see you at our next meal. Say bye-bye, Harrison. Say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> so it is day two of the road trip and we are having breakfast at the hotel. This is Howard's plate and it's um, an omelet and a bunch of bacon. And this is my plate, I got the same thing. And then I'm having some um, apple juice and cranberry mixed. Here's Harrison. Hello Harrison. He is having apple strawberries and I also got some yogurt for him and he's having milk. So this is breakfast day one, day two. All right, so we made it to Memphis. I forgot to mention this morning we had stopped and slept overnight in Little Rock, but now we are in Memphis, which is our final destination, and we stopped for lunch at the barbecue shop. It's supposed to be really good. Show you a little bit of the menu. So we've never been here, of course. We haven't ordered yet. We're still looking at the menu, but I will bring you back and show you what we ordered.
Okay, so we decided to order um, ribs and we got half dry rub and then half glazed. We each got some coleslaw and we're splitting Texas toast. And then we each got an order of beans. That's what the rib min, um, meal comes with. Today is day two in Memphis. We are having a very late lunch. We're at a restaurant called Perkins. And this is my plate. I got a, um, it's a waffle and it has like a, like a praline glaze on it with scrambled eggs and sausage. And Howard got an everything um, omelet and it has, as you can see, a lot of different stuff on there. Ham, bell pepper, onions, I don't know what else is on there. Cheese, he got a side of hash browns. And then it also comes with pancakes. Um, so this is what we are having for our late breakfast today and we'll see you at the next meal. So we are back from our trip to Memphis and the last and only meal that I recorded yesterday was our late breakfast because the next meal after that was my cousin's wedding and I did not want to record at the wedding. So we are back in town and we decided to stop by Papa John's because I did not feel like cooking. So we just got a carry out. Um, we got sausage and onion pizza. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we will see y'all next time.